Hello, it's me, Michael. I just got some money out from the bank. Um, I don't know what time it is. I should have um, should have found out when I used the bank, but uh, I guess it's um, it's probably around about four or five. Um, getting close to four, I guess, or sometime after three. Must have been. Uh, I remember I was sitting at the computer and uh, it said 2:40. So I'd say it'd be somewhere between three and four now, or four and five. I know it's not wise to get money out um, this time of the uh, morning, but um, these days I just sometimes you take a risk, um, especially when it. Um, not taking a risk doesn't seem to matter anymore. There. That's the place I was going on about before. Gaming and restaurant, bar, beer, wine, spirits. Better lit around here. McDonald's is just down the road. I have 49 minutes of film um, memory on my on my on the card, the memory card, uh, Caltex. It's open, but they don't let you inside. They have a little, um... You even have to give them your uh, card or money for a little slot in the glass wall over there when you want something, so... I don't bother with that place. Seeing as it's very hard to actually um, get what you want without walking inside the... Uh, the building. Uh, I guess that's how it is working the graveyard shift. See the, the slot there? Whoops, I think he caught me. You can get coffee. Yeah, don't want him calling the cops on me. You might not might notice a suspicious looking character with uh, a camera walking around this time in the morning. Still also have some old, old houses. I swear, I was walking around the, um, I flew to Perth once, and I was walking around the neighbourhood there, and I swear I saw the house that looked exactly like the, uh, the one from Amityville Horror, but it was just from the back. I didn't see the front of it with the, uh, the trademark windows and doors as it was. I actually tried to walk around the neighborhood to get to the front because I only saw it from the as I only saw it from the back but um I just couldn't uh, find <laughs> the uh, street it was in. I kind of got lost <laughs> getting there and uh, I think that might have been Cairns. I'm not too sure. Either Cairns or Perth. Uh, the good guys. 
They sell electrical stuff. Yeah. Hmm. McDonald's. Auntie Eggwoods. Sometimes I walk around the upper way uh, uh, along Jacaranda Road and I get uh, I can get to McDonald's along the back streets but you're still pretty much walking in the same direction as the main road and you can't really make your own path there oh, Christmas lights uh. I might continue walking past McDonald's and try, I'll have a look at Hungry Jack's, I really want to go there. They most likely be closed while McDonald's is open and only have a drive through The last time I came here last week, uh, I tried to get some food and um, my, that's when I found out my account was uh, had nothing in it. It was uh, rather upsetting. There's not a sound. I can't even hear people in the car park. I do hope it's open. Oh, there's a car. Maybe the maybe it's closed and the drive-thru is open there as well. Or maybe it's open the restaurant. It's possibly the only place open all night. Yeah, I see people walking around inside. Uh, last time I was here, there were a few people walking around. Might have been because it was on a Friday night when the, um, the pub down the road was open. And closest thing we ever to, to a nightclub here. Now, I'm not knocking the place, I've lived here, but I've lived here all my life and it's, a, it's actually more fun when you're, you're younger and um, 
it's wet. What are they trying to say? I wonder if they're open. I'll just keep walking. Sam's warehouse. This used to be a target here. Now it's um, Bunnings. Uh, they sell a lot of um, plant garden supplies, um, uh, household supplies if you're doing um, renovations yourself. If you're a, a carpenter, it's a ha very handy place to have. They serve food here during the day, they have some sort of canteen. I think they sell hot dogs and stuff. Repco, I forget what they sell there. I think it's car parts or car accessories. Discount Variety Superstore. It's another cheap shop. Lowest prices are just the beginning. Open seven days. Sam's restaurant. Sam's. Now, if everything was sold, if everything was done cheaply, then everyone would be um, more comfortable, possibly rich, I think. Well, living more comfortably. There wouldn't be so many uh, Uh, I think it's called inflation. It's when the greedy people, um, the greedy rich take the, uh, raise the uh, prices. Um, forcing people into the, uh, the poor house. Pharmacy.
there's another servo where you can get food. I think they actually let you walk inside that one. Hmm. I might actually go there instead of the restaurants. You never know, they're going to put rat poison on your burger in McDonald's. I heard about that on, the, on YouTube. Some people died. Well, some people got very sick. Um, no, it might have been... No, I think someone spat, spat in their, their coffee and they noticed the, uh, their phlegm floating around the top when they, when they were drinking it. And they made a complaint. <laughs> that's the um, that's the server. I should cross the road here. It's not safe. That's the uh, that's the car lot I was walking through, taking a walk around the back. Oops. I was walking around the back when the uh, security guard found me and told me to. Told, told me it's there's no way through there. Uh, yeah, I might just walk. Might just go here. I uh, don't know why the other people are afraid to let people inside. I'll just check the uh, hungry jacks. Uh, lights are out. They say something happened around here last week too. Someone, uh, someone got shot at or um, something out there. Was some sort of commotion. But um, I came here the other Friday night. It must have been last Friday night. Not a week from last Friday night. And um, uh, they couldn't use my, my credit card and when I checked the amount at Bevel, at the uh, Bevel uh, ATM, uh, there was no money on my account so I don't know what happened with that. Uh, I'll just show you this place. Ooh. What's this? They usually have some shows on here. Um, bands, cover bands, uh, tribute bands. Uh, no one really famous. Um, I bought tickets to see a show once, but I didn't. I didn't end up going because I had no money. Uh, by the time it, um, by the time it was on, by that stage, I'd, I'd actually uh, went into Brisbane on the same day and spent all all the money there. Uh, aside from my living expenses, what do they have here? Burlesque. Is that like... Wow, I might go there today. When's that on? Burlesque, is that how close is that to a strip? Having strippers, it's been a while since I've been to anything like that, especially in Ipswich. They don't, they don't cater for um, 
well for the type of person who likes that sort of thing anymore you have to go into Brisbane the um, the red light district in Brisbane has them uh, and some parts of the main city that's what it is the racehorse motel and further down there is um, a sports field where I was walking around and I just sat down one night when um, my computer wasn't was playing up and um, I went for a walk in the car park around the uh, swimming pool I was walking back and the police car police car started coming towards me um, it's it's just next you can't see it it's just uh, it's a building down there they've done up the swimming pool there but it looks kind of um, tacky now it used to be my high school where the, uh, the high school had their um, swimming carnivals and that was over um, 25 years ago now. Not sure whether I go to McDonald's or just this place. I might have a look inside. I might go to both places. There's, a, there's something you don't see these days a lot of, uh, a telephone booth. They're practically, uh, they're disappearing everywhere also. Um, after people started using mobiles, um, practically everyone has them now. I, I don't use them, um, don't carry them, uh, I don't, don't like having them, they're, they're, they're very fiddly. Uh, it's kind of intrusive to always having something on you where um, people can always contact you. It's kind of, um, and they're dangerous to use around uh, petrol stations I hear because they, um, um, the uh, signal could ignite um, uh, fumes. Might have a reaction with the uh, petrol fumes around here. I'll just hold the camera down as I enter, I don't want to attract too much attention. A lot of shots. It's funny as well. It just looks like you. And they've got a taxi parked around the front. Ethan, looks like it'll be McDonald's. It's not like I have a lot of choice around here. Twenty-five minutes to go. 